The Axiom 4 mission, a collaborative international human space flight led by the US-based Axiom Space, has been pushed by two days now to June 10th. But when Indian Air Force Group Captain Shubhanshu Shukla and his three colleagues do take off to space, they will be joined by a fifth crew. Joy, a miniaturized zero-gravity plushie, representing the goddess Saraswati's Vahan, Swan. Joy is the mascot for Axiom 4 mission. The Air Force Group Captain will also carry a special souvenir to honour the contribution of Wing Commander Rakesh Sharma, his mentor and predecessor in space travel. Hello and welcome to The Print. My name is Soumya Pele and in this video, I will tell you about some interesting new details from the upcoming Axiom 4 mission. At an Axiom 4 pre-launch media interaction on Tuesday, the miniaturized plushie representing the swan sat comfortably on Shukla's lap. Introducing Joy as the fifth crew of AX4, Mission Commander Peggy Whitson said, a swan held cultural connections for all the countries being represented in the mission. Shukla said that in the Hindu mythology, the swan represents the goddess Saraswati's vehicle. In the Indian context, the swan also represents the greater values of wisdom, knowledge and clarity of thought and purpose. In Poland, another country being represented in the mission, the swan is a symbol of grace, beauty and wisdom. And in Hungary, many traditional folklores have connected the swan to journeys beyond the realm of earth. Now, Joy is not just another cute plushie. It is a zero-G or zero-gravity indicator that has the important task of providing visual cues to astronauts to confirm if they have entered zero-gravity conditions in space. The tradition of zero-gravity indicators is as old as space travel itself. In 1961, the Russian cosmonaut Yuri Gagarin travelled to space and took a small doll with him to watch it float in zero gravity. Since then, everything from the Buzz Lightyear plushie to a sewn dinosaur has donned the role of these space mascots. One of the most famous zero-g indicators has been Snoopy, who has travelled in multiple NASA missions, which dates back to the Apollo missions. Now coming back to the Axiom 4 mission. The mission, which was earlier scheduled for 29th May and postponed to 8th June, will now take flight on 10th June at 5.52 p.m. Indian Standard Time. The launch will take place from the NASA Kennedy Space Center in Florida. India Shukla, who is the designated pilot for the mission, is also one of the four astronauts who have been training for India's first human space flight, Gaganyaan, which is expected to take flight in the first half of 2027. Shukla will be accompanied by Mission Commander Whitson of the US, Mission Specialist Slavosk Uznaski Wisniski from Poland and Mission Specialist Tibur Kapu of Hungary. His colleague Prashant B. Nair is the backup crew for the mission. The astronauts will be spending 14 days in the International Space Station to complete the mission objectives. With nearly 60 scientific studies and activities representing 31 countries, including the US, India, Poland, Hungary, Saudi Arabia, Brazil, Nigeria, UAE and nations across the Europe, this mission is being touted as the most researched and science-related activities to ever be conducted on an Axiom space mission aboard the ISS to date. This underscores the mission's global significance and collaborative nature to advance microgravity research in low Earth orbit. Listing out his itinerary for his 14-day stay at the International Space Station, Shukla said he will be carrying souvenirs representing various aspects of India's cultures and belief. But one of these items is extremely close to his heart, he said. A surprise gift in honour of the first Indian to travel to space, retired IAF Wing Commander Rakesh Sharma. 
Shukla said he will only reveal the details after the mission. He said that while Sharma has been a mentor and a big support in his journey to space, unfortunately, he will not be traveling to the US for the Axiom 4 launch on June 10th. We will keep bringing you regular updates from this upcoming mission. So keep tuning in to the print. You were with Soumya Pillai.